In today's video, we're working on this 2014 Porsche Cayman S and we're installing Apple CarPlay and front and rear parking cameras. Good morning guys, as mentioned, we are working on this 2014 Porsche Cayman S local customer lovely car only comes out in the dry and uh yeah it's, it's in great nick especially for a six-year-old vehicle um so this is a, an older gents vehicle and he wants a bit more of an upgrade in terms of the technology for the pcm so we're going to be giving him apple carplay and the wireless one which you've probably seen on our youtube channel and videos before but a little bit differently we are also installing a front and rear parking camera now we've done parking cameras reversing camera front cameras on porsches before but the beauty of this one is that our Porsche CarPlay system has an interface that allows for two parking cameras that we can integrate with. So James and Rich have already removed painstakingly the rear bumper and James is just over here um, installing the new camera. You can see the wiring going in here and he's going to tidy it and neaten it all up. Um, he's just prepping the plastics as you can see so that the camera can bond and it's a, it's a really nice wedge type camera but we'll go over that later on. Richard has already taken out the PCM and opened it up and you can see it just there. Um, it's ready to have the CarPlay system installed into it. Well, it's had the circuitry all redone as mentioned in the listings and the vid a previous video, so that's good to go. And then once that has been done and the rear bumper is back on, we'll then start the task of removing this front bumper so that we can install the camera and i think on this one hopefully you can see it it's going to be going around sort of in the middle of the number plate area but again we'll take uh well, i'll show you when we're doing that bit and then we'll give you a run through very quickly of the car play working and the cameras and how they work with the system so if you've got a car like this or want to do something similar then we can do it so stay tuned Okie doke, so a full day later and the Cayman S is completed. So just quickly, I'm not going to bore you to death with all of the CarPlay stuff because we do it so much, we've got other videos on it. This is really to show you if you've got a Porsche without any cameras and you also want CarPlay on your PCM system at the same time, then this is what we can do for you. So very quickly, the rear is our really nice premium gloss black wedge camera. Um, they come in black or white and they link up it's all the wiring gone all through and we're following all the factory looms all the way down the front of the vehicle to integrate with the new PCM upgrade. Um, so that's that really nice and discreet camera just there. Moving around to the front of said vehicle. Does look awesome this car, I do like it. Right, and here is the front camera. Now what we've done here is we have angled it very specifically, so, and I'll show you it in the car in a moment when we're in the vehicle, but it's a really nice profile front camera that really integrates nicely into the front of the vehicle. It's not too in your face, and, and when you're away from the vehicle, you can't really see much of it at all. We didn't, on this particular setup, because of the mesh grill that's here, we didn't want to start cutting into it and recessing it and all that sort of stuff, because A, it would affect the picture, and B, it's a, it's a real um the, the mesh is very very tight um and it's quite stiff as well so we don't want to interrupt that because as soon as you cut it it could potentially all fall apart so what we're going to do is just jump in the vehicle richard's phone is already paired up and here it is, it's on the CarPlay system in the PCM and Richard's phone is up there. So you get all your usual stuff when you push it across like here. Your Google Maps, um, your Spotify, your Apple CarPlay and it's all using your factory controls as well. So you've got all of this still intact. If you wanna go into your music, there it is. Darden Road, Better Radio, Seven Sisters. Can't ask for much more than that. So Richard is very quickly just going to show you how the cameras work. Now, um, like before, you can't. the PCM has to have your um, AUX input enabled for any sort of audio to be transmitted across. We never fit the microphone for the Hey Siri and the Bluetooth just because it would have to go up there. It would look rubbish and it's not what this is all about. We show you how to connect your phone to the original PCM Bluetooth using audio routing on your phone and all that sort of stuff. Anyway, so reversing camera, 
will work either when you're in CarPlay mode or when you are in the uh, PCM mode, so the normal PCM functionality. The front camera which activates will only activate when you're in CarPlay mode because it's all the same interface, but it can only do it when you're in this, this setup. So if you're in normal PCM, it won't work. So Rich is very quickly gonna just drop it into reverse. Give it a second, and there we go. A really nice, clear image of the rear of the vehicle, and then he's gonna pop it into drive. The front camera activates, and not much to see here, admittedly, but that's our shutter door just there, and it's a really nice, clean image um, that stays on screen for 15 seconds and then comes out after that amount of time um which is just gonna oh it's already popped out and yeah so if you've got a porsche um doesn't have to be a cayman can be a mccann or 911 or something like that as long as it's got the pcm 3.1 and you have got the aux input you're golden to go there is a new system coming out very soon uh which is allowing for the 3.0s and the cdr which is going to be quite exciting so hopefully we'll get a video of one of them up and soon um if you're into your porsches or you're into these sorts of retrofits please 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 make sure you subscribe to the channel really does make it all worthwhile for us and um, hit a like hit that bell notification and you'll always be updated when we do a new video and as always thanks for watching